Hi, this is Lotus Lee checking in for my very first YouTube video. Paying honor to St. Joseph the Worker for interceding on my behalf to help find jobs for two of my oldest children. He interceded on my behalf very quickly. I petitioned him on June 29th. And both of my children received jobs at the same place within three days. This was my very first time working with St. Joseph. And I'm very honored to work with him. He's a very warm spirit. And this candle that I have going right now is just a thank you candle basically for answering my prayer. So what I did when I petitioned St. Joseph for both of my children is I blessed a St. Joseph candle, just like the one you see here. I cleansed it with Florida water and also Palo Santo. I put seven holes within the candle because seven to me represents completeness. Then I use a job oil, a money oil, a money drawing oil to be exact, a retained money oil, Abracamino oil for opening up the way. And also Benami oil for money. Those were the oils that I used. The herbs that I used were cloves. I used cinnamon and ginger. Pecans. Oats, like Quaker oat, oatmeal. I also used, I'm thinking because I'm doing this just off the top of my head. Um, I also used some coffee around the base of my candle to bring in this ritual quick. As a matter of fact, I use all of those ingredients around the base of my candle. Everything that I placed within the candle. I use seven cloves to be exact, the ones that are on the stem. And basically, I blessed all of those herbs while placing them in my candle. I also use some green glitter. I also use some gold glitter. The prayers that I use with the St. Joseph candle, before I even got started with the particular prayer for St. Joseph the Worker, I use the Our Father prayer, Hail Mary prayer, and also the Glory Be prayer. That's what I use to pray over my candle. As I removed all negativity. And I envision my children getting their jobs. The next thing I did was I wrote each of my children's names because I did two candles, one for each child. I wrote their name, their date of birth, seven times on a brown grocery bag. I then did a separate petition with a prayer individually asking what I needed for each of their job positions. The pay rate um, amount, how I wanted their work environment to be, just every detail that I felt for each child. Now, the thing is, 
my children, both of them, well, I had one, one, my daughter, she was working at Kroger's, but basically only getting two days per week. Her check used to maybe be 40 to $60. So it just was not working out for her. My son was blocked. He couldn't find a job at all. I mean, at all. He put in several applications day after day, no calls. When he did get a call, he would do interviews over the phone and then get rejected. So I needed a little extra help. That's why I went to St. Joseph. So when I did my petition papers, I used all of the oils that I named earlier. I, I rubbed them in. I put all of my intention in my petitions. And then I folded them towards me, placed them under the candles. And then I recited the St. Joseph prayer, St. Joseph the worker prayer seven times in a row for each candle. And I just spoke from my heart. I told St. Joseph exactly what I needed to manifest into the lives of my children. Lo and behold, on the next, in the next three days, I received a text message on my phone from a random number stating that it was a job fair between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. And if you wanted a job and to be hired right away for some warehouse work, come by. Bring your ID and your social security card. So I said, wow, this is right after I lit this candle. So I knew that St. Joseph was working on my children's behalf. <clears throat> because they never applied for this job. It just came out of nowhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I was scheduled to work. But something just told me to take the day off <coughs> and not to go to work. So I called in and I took my children to the location. They went to the interview and then they filled out an application. <coughs> Ten minutes later, without any type of drug test. A background check. They were hired. St. Joseph came through. They were paid $12 per hour. And they got a 40 hour schedule. Monday through Thursday. With Friday, Saturday, and Sundays off. It was a miracle. They're still employed. They're on their second week of work. They've already gotten their first paycheck. So I would just like to share the miraculous miracle of St. Joseph with you to let you know that if you petition him with your needs and you come with a sincere heart, he will work rapidly on your behalf. So I just want to say thank you, St. Joseph, for honoring my prayer and interceding on my behalf. And matter of fact, I need a new job. I've been with my company for almost three years. On August. In August, it will be three years. And I'm looking for something new. So I will be maybe posting another video showing the spell work with St. Joseph. And also, I know I left out something. I did place water on the side of his candle. He's next to my money tree. I just have this set up in my bathroom right now because I do not have an altar space because I actually just moved in my house not too long ago. That will be coming soon. But I just wanted to, to share the miracle of St. Joseph in my life and tell you what he manifested for me in a very short time. So I hope this video will help someone. Please leave a comment, um, you know, if you want to ask me some questions. I've been doing candle work for a very long time. I just felt the need to share this to YouTube with hopes that it will help somebody through this pandemic who has not been employed. So thank you guys for listening. 
Thank you, St. Joseph, for interceding on my behalf. You guys have a wonderful day.